let's look at part a question number seven of the combined mathematics 2024 level paper so this is the derivative question so we are given a curve parametrically curve c is given parametrically by x equals l and t and y equals e to the t plus t l and t where t is positive right so we need to first show dy over dx is equal to this expression so we'll do that first so if x is equal to l and t we can find dx over dt which is <coughs> 1 over t then we know y is equal to e to the t plus t l and t so from that we can find dy over dt so that is e to the t and apply the product rule so you get l and t plus t times 1 over t so that gives you e to the t plus l and t plus 1 then using those two derivatives we can find dy over dx so that is going to be dy over dt divided by dx over dt so e to the t plus l and t plus 1 divided by 1 over t or t times e to the t plus l and t plus 1 so the first part is done we found the derivative right then what if the tangent drawn to c at t equals 1 goes through this point 1a show that a equals 1 plus 2e so we will first find the tangent so tangent is drawn to c at which point t equals 1 so we have to find the point first so substitute t equals 1 to x and y so we'll get the point first x equals ln 1 so 0 then y equals e to the 1 plus one times l n one one times l n one so that is e so this tangent is drawn at this point zero comma e right we have the point where the tangent is drawn then we will find the gradient of the tangent using the derivative so we want dy over dx value at t equals 1 so that is what substitute 1 e to the 1 ln 1 plus 1 so e plus 1 is the gradient of the tangent so now we will find the equation of the tangent line so equation of the tangent line is what y this tangent line goes through these two points so y minus e m is e plus 1 x minus 0 or so y equals e plus 1 x plus e right that is the equation of the tangent line that goes that is drawn at t equals 1 right then they have given this tangent line goes through 1 comma a point so 1 comma a satisfies this equation so substitute 1 comma a sub 1 comma a into equation 1 so a e plus 1 times 1 plus c so that gives you a equals 1 plus 2e so that is what we are supposed to show right okay so that is the answer for question number seven next we will look at question number eight